can I tell? You just know. Okie dokie. Okay. Everything's okay. Okay. Okie dokie. Okay. I'm okay if you're okay. Hey Siri. You're very beautiful. Thanks. Can we get back to work Your now? Lips are beautiful. I don't really like these arbitrary categories. <laughs> 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 wow, that guy must be happily married. No, has this has video gone viral? I'm assuming yes. if we're talking about it, it has. <laughs> Clearly. Yes, it has. It's just one of the many videos of people professing their love for Siri in the iPhone. Obviously, there's a few Easter eggs in Siri. She has a smart mouth and will kind of talk back to you if you have funny questions. Really? Like, yeah, if you say it. John, I didn't know about this. <laughs> I didn't know about that either. I, I, I'm wondering, Liz, what Siri stands for. Do we know? Um, I didn't actually look that up. So we'll you know what? I, I will check that out after this and come back with the answer at the six. But well, that's great. Yeah. So the Easter eggs, like she said, if you like say I love you to her, she'll say like I respect you. Or can we, <laughs> or, can, can we get back to work? And so a lot of people on Twitter are having a lot of fun and kind of tweeting about their favorite Siri comeback lines. Oh my but, goodness. You know, uh, a lot of tech it's bloggers. So ridiculous. I know it is. I can dog. see why it'd be fun, but. You know, okay, she's on. she's like the first personal assistant type voice command on a phone. So people are really, you know, they think it's awesome. But a lot of tech bloggers are saying it is barely gets Apple by for this phone because it just, you know, as we talked about last week, right. it just, you know, a lot of people are expecting a different design, more So features. similar, you were saying, mm -hmm. to the other one. Exactly. If you get the software update, too, you can even get your 3GS phone with the new software update. So it's kind of like, okay, well... You know, what is, as one t uh, Twitter user said, you know, if I put this on my 3GS, it basically makes it a 4S, doesn't it? So why would I buy the new one? Just to get Siri to talk to me? So you never know. There's kind I of think that was the selling point yeah. for, the, for Apple. And that is reserved, right? That is reserved for the new one, the Siri thing? Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, Siri's only for that. But actually, there was an app called Dragon Speaking or Dragon Telling. I'm sorry, I forgot to write it down. But it was available in February 2010. I feel like it's still it is on the, in the App Store, and it was a, basically a low key version of Siri, All but right. you had to open the app up. So that was kind of people's first taste of what it might be like. So of course, if you want the full effect, the full personal assistant that you can get in Siri, <laughs> you have to buy the 4S. But you know, most people are kind of buzzing that you know Siri's really awesome. Right now, I can ask her all these fun questions, but I'm curious to see how in a few weeks if it might just die down a little bit yeah the love for Siri. oh yeah I mean, yeah of gonna, course yeah, i mean it, it's, it's, yeah it. yeah and long I long think. term use with your phone too mm -hmm. is this wearing down the battery or is it gonna is siri gonna be as uh, lively as she is what now what if she malfunctions yeah. What, what happens? What if, I mean, she, what if you're I driving like and she? she <laughs> thought, I don't know. Well, yeah, no, and that's what another thing that people were joking about. They're like, you know, soon enough, you know, she can understand slang. So many different terms. I was terms. going to ask you about that too. Yes. I asked John about it earlier yesterday. We were just, uh, you know, joshing around with yeah. this phone, saying all kinds of crazy things <laughs> which we can't really say on air. But we, I'm you sure. know, when you, when you talk there. about texting and sending emails, mm -hmm. if you're upset and you want to throw in some slang yeah. or maybe mm -hmm. a couple uh, words so we should. Be saying she now, can read it. The droid, she get pick that up. I know that right now the droid, when you swear, not like I've done it or I have. Okay, I've done it. <laughs> I tested the boundaries of the droid. Uh, talk to text. Is mm -hmm. that what it's called? Whatever it is. Um, and when you do use a swear word, which I don't use in everyday use, but I was testing this. <laughs> At least uh, not it on comes show. out with the first consonant or vowel, and then it has the at sign and asterisk <laughs> and number sign and all this other stuff, or, or maybe okay. just asterisks or something like that. So. It censors you, so Google doesn't want you using swear words. Does well, Apple let you swear? Yes, it does. It asks you though first. It says, Freedom. "Is this okay?" <laughs> and then you have to say, "Okay," if you want, the, if that's what you want it to send. So wow. at least it gives you a second to kind of stop and think, which I think a lot of people. Siri's need looking out for you. Are you like, sure you want to say that? <laughs> yeah, that's I know. pretty trashy. At, but at no. what point does the computer realize? What at what point does Siri realize? I know all the answers, and this human doesn't. And just <laughs> that's what a lot of people oh are joking. Oh my goodness! You know, one day maybe Siri will you be able to say. You need to get say, away from the computer. You, <laughs> you can. <laughs> You can maybe set up your, your camera. You, you can say, Siri, does this make me look fat or something? And if she can give you those answers, oh, this that's is, where people that's are trying to top. see is Siri, objective Siri questions where wall. Siri can What's literally next? be. We'll be flying in spaceships. <laughs> exactly. Uh, oh my your, yeah, your iPhone will grow Jets. wings. <laughs> I think it's time we all took a break. <laughs> <laughs> and, and